YouTube people. We are doing switching and pitching. What we're gonna do is, we are producers, he's the pitcher. The producers are gonna give a movie title, then he has to give the opposite of the movie title and pitch that movie. Sound simple? No it isn't. Let's go. Wait. Hey guys. Oh. Hey. Hi. You know, what's it in my movie? Okay, the movie that you're gonna have to pitch will have to be the complete opposite of Sky High. You got two minutes. Go. Okay. Um, ground low. It's a bunch of underground people who are sick and tired. Okay, so this is okay. called. Uh, this is Scuds. No, no. This is ground low. Ground low. Okay. Yes. It's a. It's the. It's sort of about the mole people. Okay. They're sick and tired exactly. of the upper world treating them like the garbage they are. Okay. And so they create. Are you saying that they're garbage? Are we supposed to relate to these moles? Yes, you are. Okay. They're like. But they're it's garbage. Like, it's like the upper class trashing the lower class of society. You know, this sounds a lot like a movie I saw recently. But yeah, what's the name of the movie you saw um, recently? I don't know. I. Uh, I forgot. Someone saw it with us. But point. Point being, these mole people are like, no, dude, that we're sick. Of. Let's go show these show these upper world people we're not so bad. Okay. So so they start killing them? No, they don't start killing them. They make their way to the service. Okay. Of course, they send a diplomat up there. Like, hey, let's make some peace. Mm -hmm. And when that doesn't work, the mole people are like, no, screw it. Let's just have all out war. Wait, so oh man, that's a that's a large job. Are the mole people people or moles? They're they're mole. The mole. They, they're, they're essentially they're they're, un, they're people who live underground. That's the official term. So okay, I get this. I get this. Are we supposed? Who are they attacking? Who they're attacking the the up the uh, people of society above the world. Like are it, they it's cow a, people? It's a metaphor for class warfare. Okay, I get this. Are mole people fighting just regular? Okay, people? are we supposed <laughs> to relate? Who are we supposed to relate? You're who supposed to relate to the. The the people the, the mole people that essentially the people that live underground because okay. the people who live on the surface, which is essentially like us, they are trashing them. Okay, this I get it, they're disenfranchised. This is not like not like the Hunger Games. games. How is it like Hunger Games? There's no they mole lived people. under the ground. I mean and they were trying. No, I mean I mean I mean, like Hunger I mean games, there's a system of steps like we the weak I understand you game games. Okay, so okay, uh, we're supposed to enjoy the mass murdering mole people. We're rooting for I mean, them. We want them yes, to win. You, you want them to win. You want them to come out. Death to the, the to the overdwellers. Oh, the lead character is. You're out of time. Okay. <laughs> Let's make it. Hey! Thank Woo! you. Woo! My movie's getting made. I didn't want it. Oh. All right. It's very okay. uncomfortable. Okay, so are you ready for your movie title? No. Okay then. <laughs> well, why don't you go ahead and say, Kaylee, because you came up with it. It's the Princess Diary. Your time starts now. Okay, so this is um the dictator's <laughs> what? dictator's public pronouncements. Okay, what's it about? It's all about, it's all about this dictator that <laughs> does, says a lot of stuff out loud to other people, so they all know who it is. It's completely what, out in the public. What, what kind of stuff is he saying out loud? Like, um, I don't like that other people are alive, and also we should invade it, Cuba. Is this supposed to cause war with people, essentially? What's the, what's the okay. plot? Okay, the plot is they're a dictator. <laughs> And like he's very misunderstood. He's he's a teenage dictator, and he just realizes that he's inherited this entire kingdom, and so he just now realizes it. Yeah, well, he's he's the mini dictator. He's oh, the heir, to, he's dictator. heir to the throne type of guy. Yeah, heir to the throne. Um, okay, that which makes real sense. Real dictator is Julie Andrews. Um, <laughs> Third of who that is. What? And so Julie, what? he he's the grandson of Julie Andrews, and he's the heir to the throne, and so. He starts making a following for himself. He's he gets out of his shell and he says like, "Man, we should really invade these countries." And so maybe by he gets out. What do you mean by he gets out of his exactly shell? Like, like he starts off really soft spoken. He's a bit of like a, a shy guy. guy. Yeah, a shy a, a shy guy. <laughs> he's literally a shy guy from Super Mario. He has the mask and everything, but then he gets out of his shell. He takes off his mask. He's like, "Look at me." I'm the dictator. Okay, but what happens Future. after that? Okay. What happens? He says after, after he gets out of the show, like, dead or uh, oh, well, well, then he gets popular and he goes then to the dance and he so dances okay. with um, his girlfriend and he just he just opens up. It's a I really, the richest story. I really want to see how this girlfriend is attracted to him, like how this oh, comes about. How does out. he get popular? How does he get, how how does he get the girl? He's a dictator. Like, you get really popular when you're a dictator. You mean like. Time's up! 
I'm ditching it. I like it! Woo! Okay. Let's get this thing going! Let's go! He wins! He wins this round! 80 million dollars out the game! Yeah! Oh my gosh! Okay, so your movie is The Haunted Mansion. Go! Are they like local? They travel from across they the country to get here. It's a very large shack. Yeah. Yeah, and everyone goes there because there's is it, is it this thing about the shack where apparently people like get murdered or like. Oh, well, this doesn't sound completely normal at all. They disappear around the shack and like a ton of murders happen. Like it's around all the shack. around the shack. So but the shack so wait, is completely oh, safe. So oh, inside so the shack. Nobody is safe. ever so dies. There's no blood, no fingerprints, nothing in the shack. So it in the shack, it's safe. It's safe. It's It's a safe place. Okay. Yeah. I like it. I like this. Yeah. I like this. Keep it's going. like Let's okay. get more. Reverse horror move. That core is going around everyone, but the protagonists were completely safe. Ah. Let's get. Let's get. Let's hear more. Okay. Um. Who do who do we follow in this instance? Who's the protagonist? Um, well, the protagonist is, well, basically you're going to follow, like, five teenagers that are going to the house, but it's not really about any one of them specifically. It's just going to be, it's just, yeah, it's just going to be about the house, really. And it's going to be made out to seem really creepy and really spooky, but in the end you realize it's the only safe place. Is it like a supernatural cast? Is it like a supernatural like, entity in on the inside protecting it? Is is maybe? No, it's a completely There's normal a... house. No, it's a shack. No, it's a shack. It's a shack. I'm sorry, it's a shack. This is very important. Yes. Time's up. So you know. <laughs> you know, I'm really buying into what she's saying. You know what? We'll give you twenty million dollars to start. Um, we expect the summer <laughs> release next year. <laughs> Brody's, I'm in. I think it's a great. I think it's gonna be a great movie. I'm in. You know what? I'll like both in. I'll be an executive producer. So the point is, you win this round. Congratulations. Woo! We love your movie idea. Yay! Where's my money? Right here. Hello. And thank you for seeing us through to the end. If you just skip to this point, go back. You lazy fool. Anyways, we made a lot of progress today, so we look forward to the next summer year. What? Anyway doesn't have an S on it. You can say anyway. No, it's it's many anyway. Ways. It's one way to say anyway. <laughs> just like, like, that's just like my number one pet peeve, so like. That's your number one. That's the yeah. hill you choose to die on every time. <laughs> Thank you for seeing this video through to the end. If you didn't see it to the end, go back. That's all.